hello everyone and welcome back to my channel <laughs> so you are before we get into today's video i do want to give a little disclaimer um on y'all calendars it says that it is monday today but today is sunday over here on my channel so if you do come across come across <laughs> what <laughs> this you know let me tell you something like I said before, wine will sneak up on you. But anyway, um, what was that? I always fucking do this. Um, so yeah, today is Sunday over here on my channel. If you come across one of my community posts and you see that I'm posting a freaking um secret Sunday on Queen of the Secret Room, mind your business, all right, because it's Sunday over here. Anyway, like I was saying, today's video is a video request reading. So if you would like to purchase a video request reading, all of that information is in the description box down below. Let me just say this, okay? I have to make another disclaimer. Um, I'm lit right now. So when I'm lit and I do readings, it's automatically considered a queen of lit after dark, all right? So most definitely, um, you know, pour you a glass of wine. You feel me? Or roll up, do whatever you gotta do. Because rolling up and watching one of my readings is definitely a hobby. Period. So, so y'all, like I've been saying, I'm gonna treat these video request readings as if it was a personal reading. So I did tap into Omarion's energy. Oh wait, did I even say what this video is? Today's video request reading is on Omarion. Um, there's a lot of questions. The extended is, the extent, the link for the extended is going to be in the description box down below. Okay. Um, but yeah, I did tap into his energy because I'm treating these video quick. Blah, blah, blah. What? Oh my gosh. I'm so over it. I'm treating these video quest readings as, and then people beeping and shit. Like, bitch, really? <sighs> I can't I can't take this anyway I tapped into his energy and the first thing that I saw was the death card because I was shuffling my deck um I saw it intuitively it didn't come out but I feel like that has to do with like his energy he has some strong ass energy like very um strong masculine energy it's actually very attractive and it's like he doesn't even have to say much to like I don't know how it's just like I don't know it 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 makes you feel some type of way. Another thing that I was picking up, like even people that like fucks with him, he intimidates um the same sex a lot. Like even people that like are in his circle, it's like they, they kind of feel triggered by him sometimes. Because, like, his energy is so commanding. I like it. I do like it. So, we're going to get into these questions. Um, I believe that there's 15. Um, half of the questions have to do with um, him and April. And half of the questions have to do with, like, his career and projects that he has coming out. So, the first question that I'm going to answer is um why did he fall out with his best friend caesar i don't know anything about him i don't even know who this nigga is i don't know who none of these niggas are oh my goodness that's so, oh my gosh that's so funny i'm sorry oh my goodness <laughs> I don't know who none of these motherfuckers is. It's so f Ooh. Because he's sneaky. Um. Bitch. Oh my goodness. First card out got me wanting to clarify. <sighs> I don't want to say that. I feel like he was. He's just sneaky. Yeah. I feel like he's very sneaky. And it's like, there's things that he partakes in that he doesn't want to be attached to. I feel like Omarion is like, 
Ooh, I feel like he's spiritual. And it's like he, this guy does too much. This guy does too much. And he's sneaky and like. He feels like he plays himself. Oh. Yeah. And I feel like he lied about something. Because when this card comes out, this is giving me, especially with this like Seven of Swords energy, also down low energy. We ain't gonna get into that. It's like, yeah. Oh my goodness, I was picking this up. He's spiritual and this other guy, I feel like he's ratchet. And another thing that I'm getting, a lot of people were, like, talking about them um, and their friendship. Like, oh, they must be, <laughs> they must be, like, you know, fucking around with each other. And they didn't like that. Yeah. I feel like Omarion is in a, is he in a secret relationship? Because I see a baby coming in for him. But, um, yeah. Oh, bitch. Wait, somebody felt like somebody stole some money. This could have been, like, on a project, but somebody feels like somebody stole some money. Because I'm also getting, like, the Ace of Pentacles. What is this? Is that the Ten of Pentacles? I hate when shit falls all the way over there. Oh, the Five of Freaking Wands. Yeah, they had a disagreement. I feel like it was over money. I feel like it was over money. But yeah, it's slow for that shit. And I'm also getting like, they just outgrew each other. Like, it wasn't really that deep. All right, so the next question is, why did he change management musically? Let's see. Why did he change um, management musically? Because a contract was severed, like it was over. Um, another thing that I'm getting, he wanted to venture out to do more things. Um, this is talking about a business that he wants to like start. Like he wants his foot in the music industry and in another industry as well. I feel like he's in a relationship. I feel like I feel like he is in a secret freak relationship. Um, again, I'm getting this energy like he's, he feels like people are stealing money from him. He feels like people have stolen money from him. Um, whether that be projects, actual things, ideas, um, lyrics, beats. Yeah, he feels like a lot of people have like stolen things from him. I'm getting that, like, not only was it, was a contract, you know, severed, but it's, like, to protect his fortune. Like, I feel like a lot of people, well, this is from his perspective, like, really, yeah, they, they, they steal, um, money and project and ideas and, um, accolades from him. This is weird. All over, yeah, Queen of Swords with the Ten of Pentacles. Oh, another thing. This is super messy. Okay, so there's a Sagittarius female. Um, she could have an air moon placement. Libra or really? Cancer? Um, and this she's like this 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 female 
Damn, and I hate that I feel like she's a Sagittarius because her masculine energy is the king of wands. Ooh, did you hear that? Yeah, I'm speaking facts. Um, like, this person's very depressed. I feel like they do coke because he doesn't even want to, like, give this person time of day. I definitely feel like this is a scorned lover. But, yeah, it's just, like, people being too sneaky in the business, in the music industry business. And the people that he, like, collabs with. He just was not happy. He was not happy at all. Yeah, two of swords. Yeah, he wanted to just be by himself. Okay, there is... You know what, child? Listen to me. This is ridiculous. I'm trying to, like, ask questions um, about other stuff going on with him. And this is really sticking out. This person is, like, on the path to destruction. I feel like there's a, again, she could have, like, a, a air moon placement. And him being impartial is literally killing her. Okay, so I just want that to be known, whether or not what's going on, because I definitely feel like she antagonized. Okay, this is April. I don't know what the bitch placements, but that's just the energy that I'm getting. It's like she antagonizes him a lot in many different ways, and he sees all of it. He sees all of it, but he's very impartial to like, I don't even give a fuck about you. And that kills her. But anyway, it was just like, listen, literally death with the three of pentacles. I need to end this shit because I'm not happy. He, he just wasn't happy. He wasn't happy. All right, let's get into the next question. This big ass deck. <sighs> Why did his unreleased album Reasons get shelved? Why did Reasons get shelved? I'm getting um joy pro blah, 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 what I'm getting joy project with this um and what is a joy project it's a project that brings you um emotional fulfillment without the monetary aspect of it yeah um another thing that I was get that I'm getting is <sighs> I'm not gonna say that that people weren't interested yeah but like the rollout wasn't wasn't the best i'm getting like the four of cups energy he feels slighted about that too okay there's a lot of things regarding his career that he feels slighted about and it's like this like like people do me wrong and i don't really say shit like i don't speak on it i don't expose it he feels like a scorned industry person this is weird Yep, he feels like he got he got that the Yeah, like enough people were intrigued by it, but it wasn't gonna do I'm getting the energy like it wasn't gonna really be hitting on anything because of just I'm getting people were just kind of disinterested. I'm gonna be honest. Like this is general public. This is not for his fans. I'm not talking about his fans. Um but definitely, he feels like he got slighted business-wise as well. Yeah, Five of Cups. The Empress. King of Wands. Made some coin off of it. He did make some coin off of it. But let me tell you something. You can't get shit past me, all right? I can see through every sneaky motherfucker. I can see through every sneaky situation. I'm smelling work up in here. I'm smelling mother freaking work, period. Um, But he, he made some coin off of it. But again, it's like getting slighted business-wise. I feel like a uh, female energy put some work on him for his career because she knows that that is 
the one thing that could like hurt him that will hurt his feelings i feel like he has he he bases a lot of his pride and ego he could have a very strong leo or aries placement um on his career yeah because <laughs> because he just does not he's very impartial to her Oh, another thing that I'm getting, he really wants to take his kids from her because she's very, she's, she's a, she's a mother freaking, okay, if, if, if it was the feds, she's a flight risk, okay, she can't get no damn bond, um, he really wants to protect his daughter because she brings her children around a lot of different guys, a lot, and some of these men are like drug dealers. I mean, everything that I say is alleged, but I am getting like some Wanda energy. And if you know what, ugh, bitch, if you ever seen Holiday Heart, then you fucking know what's good, bitch. You know what the fuck is good. Yeah, and another thing, I'm getting that she exaggerates the hell out of situations. Like, all right, <laughs> this is him. He, I feel like he's in a secret relationship. I feel like he is very happy. Again, I'm getting some abuse. I'm getting some mental illness with this as well. Um, Because I don't have my mental health issues card in this deck. It's in my other deck. Let me get my other deck. But... Yeah, I'm getting the same energy. It's like she she drags it like, oh my goodness, she drags the fuck out of situations. Like, let's say somebody, um, let's say she had a friend, right? And they were cool one day and then they have a little falling out. She'll go out her way to like tell people, oh, this person trying to set me up or they never were real. When it was like, girl, y'all just had a disagreement. Like, it's not that deep. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like she drags situations. Like, oh my gosh, he's trying to kill me because he's taking my kids away. But are you facilitating an environment where your kids can mentally and spiritually thrive? No. So it's like, you you just on some bullshit. Like, he's very annoyed with her. That's why he, and he knows that it kills her that he is impartial. So that's why he is fucking impartial he treats her listen to me this girl okay she's her energy is getting on my nerves her energy is getting on my freaking nerves like for real for real for real <laughs> oh my gosh look i said that bitch listen to me i, I freaking said that didn't i say that all right and I'm also getting, um, I'm also getting, you know, like, whole energy. Major whole energy. I cannot wait to get into these motherfucking April and, not little sis. What is it? April and, oh, this isn't supposed to be here. What is this? Bitch spell work. Look, I had this deck. And this card is not supposed to be in this deck. And it was spell work. Yeah, this girl, I know you lying. And it's like because he was just not, I don't think he was faithful to her, but I don't feel like he was faithful to anyone. And what I mean by that, it's like he's, he's just, uh, I'm not going to say that he's unfaithful, but he is like, Girls just throw themselves at him is the energy that I'm getting. And it's like, would you, you, you want, you want me to, if you, if you want to keep on throwing a ball, bitch, I'm going to pick that up and I'm going to throw it back is the energy that I'm getting. Oh my goodness. All right. Let's get into the next question. Cause I know you're lying. Um, which sex do I want to use? I don't know. Will his upcoming album be successful? 
Will it succeed? I just heard he is tunnel vision um, on putting his foot on these motherfuckers next. And I feel like that's in, if that's in regards to like his ex bandmates. He feels like they do too much. They talk out their neck a lot too. Let's see. Will this upcoming album succeed? Yeah, I keep on seeing the Ace of Wands. Eight of Swords, Justice. Will it succeed? Yes, but not in the way that he wants it to. Not in the way that he wants it to. I feel like he needs to strategize better on how he's going to do this rollout. And I feel like he's hard on himself as well. Yeah. And it's something about, um, what is it called? Some stagnancy that I'm getting. All right, listen to me. I'm so pissed off that my camera, um, <laughs> cut off but the eight of swords confirming the eight of swords I feel like he's a perfectionist I feel like it's gonna do good but it's not gonna do um it's not gonna be as successful as supposed to be because I'm getting that's what he's striving for um it's like knowing that you can obtain that a-list spot like that uh, what is it called and I'm not trying to throw no shade I'm not saying that he's not an a-list celebrity but he's you know what I'm saying? Just like getting back to like re relevancy. What the hell? Yeah, five of pentacles, ten of swords. <sighs> I feel like publicly he's going to get some good accolades, but it's not going to really bring in that much money. Yeah. I feel like it's going to do okay. I, th I feel like it's going to be okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's just the energy I'm getting. <sighs> All right, let's see. Oh, page of swords. Okay, what will he... Oh, no. Will he discuss his baby mother in his upcoming book? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> I'll definitely feel a baby for Omarion. Definitely. Oh my goodness! I know you lying! Let me move my wine bottle! <laughs> oh my gosh, I cannot believe that happened! By the way, I do not have more than one. It's only one. It was hitting a candle um, that I had. Oh, shit. Yes, I feel, like, I feel like he is. Let's see. Bitch, I can see the Taj K coming. So I know you lying. Will he discuss his baby mother and his upcoming book? <laughs> yeah, he will be discussing the past. Look, <laughs> Queen of Wands. And she knows that. I feel like she is going to be up on that ass. Yeah, he is. I'm getting that they're going to be, yeah, I'm getting that they're going to be friends. Nothing, nothing more than that. Because of her, she's just toxic. She's super toxic. And I feel like he's going to get a very good response out of this. He's also going to be talking about things that he has not addressed, such as things that were happening um, behind the scenes, behind the scenes of B2K and things of that sort. Yeah, it's going to do good. Ooh, yeah, bitch. And, um... Toxic things that have went on 
in the music industry that he had to experience. Bitch, but he coming for that ass. He coming for that ass. I mean, <laughs> do feel like he's going to try to keep it cute for the kids. Because that's his number one concern, like, the kids. That's what I keep on hearing. But, yes, this is going to be very profitable. Yeah, he's going to... I feel like he's going to make more money on this than he's been making in music. Like, period. What's the Five of Pentacles? But I'm not getting disrespect. I'm not getting disrespect. I feel like she disrespects him a lot, but I'm not getting that energy from him. It's like once you have gotten over a situation, you never are really going to be pressed about that situation. Like you might you might think about it and like, oh, yeah, that was messed up. But I'm getting that he's so impartial when it comes to her because of not only how she carries herself, but just the type of person that she is like he's over it. I feel like they're keeping it cordial, period, and I, I do not feel like she likes that. Well, I know she doesn't. I know she doesn't. Oh, my goodness, bitch. So, let's see. What will April expose in her book? What will she expose in her book? Mm, mental health issues. I think she's going to talk about, like, her depression. Yeah, and her drug use. Is this Omarion? I don't think that she's going to expose celebrities, but, like, kind of. Like, I feel, I'm sorry. I'm getting this passed around energy. Yeah, I'm getting this passed around energy. <laughs> I feel like she's going to air out a lot of toxic shit in her life and, like, how she's turning it all around. But I'm not getting the energy that she is. Yeah, bitch, listen to me, period on period. So, that's that's just that on that, okay? She's money hungry, like, period. I feel like her, yeah, I feel like her book, the rumors of, <laughs> the rumors of facts, <laughs> period. The rumors of motherfucking facts. Um, I'm also getting something about a terminated pregnancy, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm getting this passed around energy. I'm just going to keep it freaking real with you. But anyway, we are going to finish this reading in the extended. If you would like to watch the extended and be a part of this fuckery, I mean, because it's some fuckery. And I say it's some fuckery because her energy is just off the freaking chain. But anyway, if you would like to, um... Let's see the extended. The link was going to be in the description box down below. If the video ends here for you, thank you for stopping by. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I will see you in my next video. If you will be following me into Queen Alice's room, I will be waiting for you at the dump.